Alright. Hello, YouTube. Uh, okay, that was bad timing. Okay, so, what I want to show you today is uh, off how to get this Kodak, because every time I do this, I get this weird script error thing, and I'm going to show you that in the video. But, this is the camera that I own. It's a really nice camera, but I was having trouble, and I couldn't find anything on YouTube that would tell me how to do this. So, first thing you're going to need is a USB cable, which I'm plugging in at the moment. And you're going to need to have a USB for your camera, which if you have the camera I have, you're going to have that. Let me plug that in real quick. There we go. So, plug into my camera. And there you go. See? It says, open the setup app, right? So, I'm going to come over here, and I'm going to do exactly what it says. There, there it is. See? Open the computer. So, hold on. Open my computer. Locate the Kodak setup. Run Kodak setup app. Set up your camera. And which also means, like, get the pictures and stuff like that, and import whatever you want to import. So, when I try to do that, I got this. Yeah, not fair, is it? Let me zoom in real quick. Yeah, see that? That's not very fair, huh? Not to me, it isn't. So, I'm just going to exit out. And don't tell me, like, because you're, like, don't get in the comments and be like, Hey, if you just press that, yes, it'll work. No, it doesn't work. What you're going to do, I'm going to unplug it. <laughs> Your camera comes back. All right, hold up. So, let it do its thing. It's working. So, you see that little thing on the top right there next to the little head thing that looks like a wrench you're gonna click that and there's your settings so come down here you're gonna want to see right there how that says Kodak software you gonna want to send it to other application you wanna come all the way I'm not sure if this is how it works or not but I've done this before so there you go back out and then you're gonna to plug the USB back into your computer don't open anything no, don't delete that picture. I need that. Okay, so, go back over here. And that's just a sample picture, by the way. I haven't taken much pictures on this camera. And, uh, there's nothing to import. Oh, yeah, I'm sorry. That's because I... Okay, so, it's because I've already imported it. Okay. Let me get this camera back. Okay, so, look. So, I'm just gonna take a random picture of something in my room, right? There we go. Take a picture of that. So, say that I want that picture on my wall now. Hang on, let's put the camera right here. Um, there we go. So there we go, and your camera fills it, and then it says, um, this won't come up right away. There'll be a box that comes up right here, and then you're going to click on that. And then there's going to be something else. You're going to click the, the top one, and then you're going to press import when this comes up, and it'll say that. So now when I get out of here, and I go to my files, and I come over here, I'll see right over here on, um, it, it should import the pictures, right? Yeah, so there they are. And it imported... No, these aren't my pictures. These are just my weird dog. Um, hold up. And my hat. Get the... Go away. I want to come over here. When you come down here, you go to pictures. And... Pictures. And then there they are. So, it's going to name them. You can name the files, whatever you want. And these are the pictures. This is the one I did the first time because that was a failed attempt at a... To a video this is the one I just took see and that's how you do it off of a Kodak camera if you keep getting that script error I couldn't find anything on YouTube and I thought that that would that this would be unique for me to do and, um, and that's all I wanted to tell you guys and um, well yeah I'll see you later bye